Yes. Again, just trying to prove to everyone what we're really capable of, trying to prove to ourselves as well. Um, so to be able to go through these first two games and only give up six total points, I think it's big for our confidence moving forward. So. Isaiah? Yeah. Great game defensively, but on the return that you fumbled, what was going on and how happy were you to see who recovered it in the ensuing play? Uh, yeah, I mean, it was kind of just a bang bang play. I was trying to break too many tackles, I guess. Uh, the coaching point would just go down a little sooner, but I mean, end up in a touchdown. So, I mean, just to see uh, LaVisca pick it up, I kind of saw it from the back. I saw him running, and I knew he was going to score. So, that kind of uh, made me a little happy, but definitely going to clean that up moving forward. What did that do for the team emotionally? Oh, I think it brought us together. Uh, it definitely hyped us up, getting it, getting on the board. Um, maybe not in that specific fashion, but just getting points on the board was good for us. Uh, kind of just kept us rolling through the rest of the game. Isaiah, just one uh, offensive touchdown in the first half. How do you describe that group, sort of what their emotions were in the locker room, just went walking by them and, and trying to observe a little bit? I mean, as a, as a team, we always have the utmost confidence in our offense. Um, I've always been a firm believer that it takes a, a couple games for offense to get rolling. Uh, you can see that across the nation. It doesn't matter how many how many great athletes you have or, or this and that on the offense. It takes time because it's a, it's, a, it's a real big system. Um, and once they get clicking, I know that they're going to be capable of scoring however many points we need to win any game. So, I mean, they're, they're getting rolling, and I know that they're going to be better next week. Evan, their first play of the game, they bust through a 55-yard run. Isaiah runs them down. From that point on, you guys locked down. Was there something on that play just a breakdown for you guys, and, and did you consciously, from that point, lock down? We just knew we had to be ready after that. You know, that was just a mess up on the defense. But after that, we just picked it up, and we was just ready for anything. You haven't given up a touchdown in two weeks. Are you that good? <laughs> I mean, yeah, we're just going to do what we, uh, what we do, and we're going to keep doing it. So that's what we do. Are you that good? Uh, yeah, I would say we are. Um, to uh, what Coach Elliott has brought, um, what Coach Ellis has brought, Coach Brown, I mean, they understand the system. They understand the defense. Um, we play fast. We play as hard as we can um, every single play. So if that's something we'll be able to keep up, then that's great um, going in. From on, on to the season, obviously, it's not realistic to give up zero touchdowns for the entire year. But, I mean, anything that our offense gets, one catch, one big run, I mean, we take that to heart. So we try to prevent anything from happening. Isaiah, can you go through that interception again? Uh, yeah. Uh, it was kind of much like the play from last week um, where I broke it up against Colorado State. But this time, I was just able to catch it. I mean, it was just the inside release. Um, the ball was Pretty well thrown, a little to the outside. Could have been a little better, I think. But I mean, I just knew I wasn't be able to get two hands on it, so I just tried to tip it to myself, and it just worked out well. Isaiah, did that feel good, especially if you caught the ball up in the in the first half to kind of haul one back in? Oh yeah, most definitely. I mean, just being able to hold the ball in your hands is always fun when you're playing football. So, what were your impressions of the interception? Seeing that he's being humble about it. <laughs> you know, I just ran downfield and was looking for someone to block, but <laughs> felt like I kind of messed him up. He ran into me towards the end, but, you know, we're going to get one this year, so. Ed, Evan, for you, um, having been out all of last year and you coming in having a pretty good first two games, what does it mean to you to, to have the impact that you've had so far uh, through the first two games? Uh, it feels great, you know, being out here playing football again. This is what I love doing, so I just love coming out here doing what I'm supposed to be doing, so, yeah, it just feels amazing. Evan, it seems like you're playing a lot faster than when you were here before. What, what, is that, what do you attribute that to? Uh, you know, I just got that drive, you know. I'm just trying to do what I need to do. I just got to always be playing 100%, can't mess up, just always going full speed. Any more questions for the defensive guys? All right, thanks. Appreciate it.